Hey guys, what is up? It's Wolf, your one and only, and Twin Saga is now open beta, so you all can join in now. I'm just sitting here creating my character, and we are actually done. So I can actually just start up the game and get right into it. Now, I'm not really sure if you guys want me like read or slowly skim through them all, so you guys can pause and read for yourself. But for now, I'm just going to pause and let you guys read for yourself. I'm going to slowly just click through everything so you guys can read it. I normally like to go back and read on my like recordings. That's just came natural to me. All right, it seems like a little of our story has stayed the same. We didn't do like too much changing to the dialogue at the moment. Okay, now there's one thing I want to show you guys. Dragon Knight is now in the game, so they it seems they did take it out and just put it inside the game. Now, I thought that might be the case. I was not sure at first. But I saw other people playing with it, but I wasn't sure if it was like a different version or if it was Korea or something. So it seemed like we didn't have it at the moment. So now we do have it. It is back in our possession, so I can change to it now. Oh, wait, whoops. I did not slowly skim through that. Wait, hold on, let me start over. And get all that out of the way. I'm so used to when I start, like, I've already played something, I just start skimming through it until I get to where I last left off. Where I last left off is when I got to Rogue. And Rogue class is probably my favorite class in this game, which I'm going to be fighting for. I have no idea where the music went at all. So what I'm going to do is go in here and change the music. Because it seemed to have died. Okay, really? There we go. Now get off. Oh yeah. I had music muted for like my stream. Now I'm not going to be streaming this game because, you know, everybody wants me to do a walkthrough of it. Or a playthrough. Whichever one you guys were asking for. So, I'm going to be doing that with this game. So, each episode is going to probably be like 30 minutes, depending on how you guys feel. You know, I don't want to make it like too long, because if I make it too long, everybody's going to lose interest in it. So, it's going to be about like 30 minutes each part. Alright. Was he now? It was funny because they put the um, actual kawaii inside of the captions at first. Then he did change some of the dialogue. Uh, you guys are so cute and adorable. Too bad I gotta end your life. So I have not used 
this class, so... Actually, looks pretty awesome. This move actually looks... pretty fleshed out. Alright. Now we're gonna beat the crap out of him. <laughs> I don't know if I can ever get tired of that. It's just so satisfying. Ultra moves. Yeah, ultra moves you can use at like any time. It just takes your like gauge to be filled up. Uh, yeah, it takes this gauge to be filled up. When it's full or like whatever your skill requires. Can I move this over? Nope. I'll show you guys afterwards. But just max then you can use it. You could buy pushing F. Yeah. All right. Yep, it takes a full bar just to use this skill. So I do plan on doing PvP inside of this. But that's going to be later on when I get Rogue and have everything, like, prepared for PvP. じゃあ、俺の客がここに寝転んでるのはどうしてだ。下船な人間ごときを高貴なる精霊であるあなたが気にする必要はないでしょう。それにこの私に従えばかつての身分。So pretty much these are rivals and she's trying to recruit um Samuel. Like she's pretty much like わが騎士になると誓いなさい。Pretty, like, one of the villains, or pretty much the main villain of the game. I haven't got all that far into the game yet. There's multiple villains. You guys are wondering why I'm not phased because, yeah, after being through this once, you know, I kind of want to skip through, but it's a playthrough. Yeah, I don't know. You guys tell me how you feel about these first two episodes and... Then I'll pretty much do on what you guys are actually telling me. I could skip through all the dialogue and just keep going on doing quests. Or I could slowly just click through for you guys and skip through a lot of things. Who knows? Who knows? It's all up to you guys, to be honest. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention I'm wearing a hat just because I haven't like fixed my hair. I just woke up and I didn't feel like fixing it. I just said screw it. Let's just put a hat on and do this. All I gotta say is Samuel's a boss in this game. Oh yeah, that's the first dude we didn't, we never saw like fight with us. We saw him in like the cinematic, but he never actually fought with us. Yeah, he's still not fighting with us. He like disappeared. Yeah, I I, I don't get what they're for doing. 
Oh, okay. He's one of my um summonings. If I could just summon him anytime I want. Okay, that's why he was fighting with us. I'll explain a lot of things. I'll make a lot of uh, tutorial videos so you guys can understand the game a little bit more. So that'll be in the middle of the series and farther in. When I first saw that, all I could think of was, oh my god, that is so shiny. And here comes his grand exit. I don't know. I already did a first impressions on this, so wouldn't I leave off from where the first impression last left off? Eh, I'm not sure. Eh, oh well. Considering that they just got into open beta, I'm pretty sure it's alright. Because they did change up some things. Alright, so now we are in game. We actually see a lot more players than we did in closed beta. I wonder how much things did they fix and how much things did they add in. Alright, I just signed in for day one. Oh, I got a, another one of these, but it's not the lucky one. It's the chubby one. Ah, uh, you do look kind of chubby, buddy. Oh, I got me a new friend. Wait, no, it's still lucky. Okay. Chubby and lucky. Okay, okay. Yeah, you know what? I'm not even gonna question it. We're just gonna continue on. Alright, I think we just leveled up. Now let's look at this old man's stuff up close. Oh, I wish you could zoom in a lot closer. Nice detail. I wonder, can I go up here? Oh, no, I can't go back there. That sucks. Nothing too different. I never noticed those stairs right there. I'm gonna go explore later. I almost like zipped through everything. I'm so sorry. It's like I have it. Especially since this is like the main story. Because I, I believe I already read all this. I made a second character and played through. Alright. Let's go up here. What is up here? Yeah, it's it's a cute dress in your eyes. 
Doesn't seem like anything is up here. Yeah, nothing's up here but a quest down here. I'm gonna go to it. Why not? Why'd I do that? Because you have to read these green quests. If you don't read the green quests, you're going to be really lost because they don't give you, like, an actual quest over here. You have to actually, actually solve this quest, which makes it a lot more difficult. They make you actually read it. Okay. Where is she? Pretty sure we can search on the map for NPCs, right? Doesn't seem like she's on here. What? Well, I guess she's an NPC without reason or purpose. So that means I have to find her. Oh yeah, I guess you guys remember this. If you stay by uh, like NPCs, they... If you stay by NPCs that have these little icons on them... Uh, they have like dialogue and they start talking to each other. So once you sit close to them enough to where their dialogue just goes fully through... You unlock like... Achievement and a title. I don't know why I was pointing at the screen like you guys could see it, but, you know, you can see it by heart. Oh, there she is. My lord's here. Oh god, why are you guys making me find so many things? All right. Is that person there? Up here at all? Nope, gotta find that person also. Gotta make sure that he or she is not up here. All right, nope, they're not. So we can just safely go down here. This is why I like the uh, green quest because they make you look around more. There he is. And back we go. Right. Right. Wait, is it Stanley we're supposed to be talking to? Yep. Yeah, make sure to read these as well. Now we take it to her, or we're done here. Not only that, we get like mail, but I cannot open mail until I'm level 10. Thanks game. Thanks. But at least we know we have mail. But that is a daily quest, so you guys can do that daily. Just memorize everything you do, and you guys should be able to do it like as quick as possible. Gotta jump down here. Yep. 
No fall damage. I might do some uh green quests on the way. Cause I like just like sitting there and figuring out quests. Puzzles are like fun things for me in RPGs. Especially figuring out figuring out dungeons. That has always been fun. Oh darn it. Oh no, I don't have to move my face cam over. I forgot. I moved everything over so it wouldn't be in the way. I'm surprised it saved those settings. Like, what am I surprised for? It saves my um, actual options. Oh yeah, that's the guy who... Yeah, I'll, I'll explain those in the video. I have a lot of video tutorials for this game because it has like so much in it. So I'm not sure how the whole bot thing is going to work out. I really hope there are. doesn't seem like there's bots down in the description because they would be spamming chat by now. But they're not, which is surprising. So they did something or hackers aren't interested in it. Well, botters, whichever you want to call them. Thank God. Whoa, dude, you have quite the big backpack there. Got a helmet on it and everything. Man. Wish I could carry that around. It'd be like an actual adventure. I'm trying really hard not to get like sucked into that game because when I suck get sucked into the game I get very quiet. And speaking of the devil, never mind. There's there's a fodder right there, already shadowing out cheats. Oh, not cheats, uh, scams. Well, hopefully they'll do something about it. It's surprising because there's not many of them right now. Right now. So let's look at this dialogue. Good heavens, never a juice seems you want. Yeah, let me just go up for you guys. There you go. Like the dialogue goes way faster than I read out loud. I we I read way faster in my head than I do out loud. That is probably why I won't be reading a lot of this stuff that's going on. Cause it will just take me quite a while to finish it off. Alright, so we got one, two oh god. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, I like to fully, fully finish an area before I actually go on. So I might do, like, all the green quests. I'm just a guy who likes achievements and accomplishments. So I might try to find all the, uh, what, what are they called? Uh, all the little chat achievements. If I run into them, that is. I'm not going to try and find every last one of them. That comes at endgame. If there is one. Alright. Quest. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Green quest. That's gonna probably take me a while to finish. So this is going to be a long series, but it's actually going to be pretty fun. For me, that is. And dude, you look like you've ate one too many. I like that mustache, though. Mustache is fantastic. Alright, here's another one. Oh, 
Well, not anything. Come on. Oh god, what is she gonna say? Okay, at least it's not anything over dramatic. Dramatic she asked for. Birthday present. She made it. oh faithful. Great, great. So what's up here? Let's go exploring. Maybe I'll find some things that you guys never went to. You guys can see that weird shadow, right? Like, that's not even a reflection of the sea. It's like a weird, like, reflection of the sea being all the way up here and, like, reflecting the tree. That is strange. I'm pretty sure I can jump down there. Hold on. Okay. Nope. I cannot. I thought I could swim. What am I thinking? My character is dark-skinned. You know we can't swim. Please don't demonetize me for that. Alright. Wonder, can I just oh I can't oh god. There we go. I can sell my ship. Oh, I know where I'm sitting. Whenever I like get off the game and go away, okay. Oh yeah, that's another interesting thing about this game. You can actually, um... You actually sit down in furniture, which is, like, really interesting. Because not all RPGs, like, let you sit down in fur furniture. Because there's a lot of games where they look like they would let you, like, do a lot of things, but they won't. So, in this game, you have an option to do that. Oh, I can't look at the quest again? Alright. Oh dear god. Ah, oh, she gave me cake. Mmm, tasty. Oh, I can right click this one and go to it. Sweet. Last time I tried this, they wouldn't let me right click it. Okay, where are we going? Where are you taking me? You bastard. You bastard. Oh, he disappeared. Okay. I can't chase him down. I fell into his trap. He tricked me. How could he? Bounty manager. I have never talked to you. Alright, I'm afraid you cannot get the reward. You don't have proof of valor. I am a bounty five times and have enough. Huh. What do you mean by valor? Oh, we'll see. Sure, I'll find him for you. Why not? Why not? Search the pumpkins outside of town. God, that went away very quickly. Is there like a way I can like make open dialogue up here? Filter. Nope. There's no way I can keep the dialogue up, up right here at least. That sucks. I'm not gonna use his fur. Can I right click that? Nope. So I literally have to go over here. Where the pumpkins are. Can I use it now? Realize you're holding fur that's Check the pumpkin patch for clues. Okay, for clues. So I guess the...
Oh, yeah, I thought that was him at first. I guess the quest items have, like, the little hint on them. I'm trying to figure out which pumpkin patch. Like, there is... It's like a huge patch everywhere. We have gotten a new skill. Molten Claw. Seems Dragon Knight has a lot of fire elements to it. Alright. Is that another pumpkin patch up there? Kill these birds while I'm at it. Oh god. Nah, they're alright. They aren't like the biggest pumpkins in the world. Okay, that's probably not the smartest idea buying one bigger than your house. Okay, that's uh, stretching it a little. I don't think a person would marry you over a pumpkin, sir. <laughs> All right, let's kill these guys up here while we're at it. Searching around. Uh, doesn't seem like I see any clues. Is this the pumpkin patch? Let's read that again. Yeah, it just says pumpkin patch. It's not. There's like a large number of pumpkin patches. Is this the one over here? Ah! Okay. this? Am I just picking these up for no reason? I'm pretty sure I am. Do I talk back to the kid? I didn't even get to see the dialogue because it went down so fast. That is weird. So, I checked this patch, said no red, that's all I saw. What about back here? No? That is weird. But we have reached our time limit, guys. I know that green quests take a while to finish, especially if, like, it doesn't, like, go straight forward. But, oh, there it is. There you are. Oh, I believe we finished this quest before... We actually ended it off. Come on, buddy. Oh my god, where did you come from? I'm gonna kill you before I end off this episode, okay? That's if you're still here by the time I get back. Wait for me. Your days are numbered. I don't have a mount to vastly get over there. Okay. I... I... Oh, God. Okay. Get in the way, Mr. Bird. Okay, yeah, my... This was just dialogue I already seen. Uh, was was that the uh, was that the poor bird that I just gave to him who said help me? Oh god, I think I murdered a bird. Ah, oh, there he is. Hey, buddy, what's up? I'm just gonna kill you, okay? This 
is how we're going to end off this episode. By killing you and getting blocked by a tree. I don't know how I leveled by punching you, but you know what happened. Kill it. All right. So I beat the giant purple chicken. So we're going to call it an episode here, guys. And I will see you guys on episode two, which I'm about to record. So I'll see you guys on episode two. Peace out.